Disney on Ice has shows now through Sunday at the Memorial Coliseum. Two of the skaters are here with us, Hope and Kathleen, and uh, tell us about this big show. Well, Disney on Ice presents Dare to Dream is really your ultimate princess experience, mm -hmm. basically. So there's four major princesses that we feature. We start off with Princess Tiana in New Orleans. Then we go to Snow White with Seven Dwarves, Snow Prince, all of that. And then we head to Cinderella, where you have the Fairy Godmother and, of course, Prince Charming. And then we finish off with Rapunzel and Flynn Rider on their huge adventure. So. And from some of the video, I think it looked like that you had horses skating and I mean this is oh, yeah. this is well this is Disney. <laughs> yeah, yes. Maximus yeah. Magic happens. Magic happens everywhere. So uh, what are you, what are your parts in the show? I'm an ensemble skater, right. so basically that means that we skate all the different group roles. There could be four to six different parts we skate in a show. So me and as, well. as well. Yes. And so does that mean big big giant costumes that you're trying to skate in? <laughs> For sure. Yeah. Yes, yes, lots of costume pieces. There's over a hundred costumes in the show. Wow. <laughs> Yes, wow. definitely. Giant ball gowns. I wear a big green ball gown in Cinderella's ball. It's mm -hmm. huge, beautiful, covered in glitter. Of course, to wear the jewels. Very nice. <laughs> so this is this a? Um, let me. I'll I'll ask for the. Uh, for the, for the you know seven year old boy I once was, is this all for girls? Is it just princesses? No, definitely not. I mean, you have Flynn Rider, who I mean, he literally takes Rapunzel up in the air and they fly, yep. as you can see over yeah. there. Um, you know, they're flying through the air over seven meters above everyone. So it's a very athletic show. Of course, you have Mickey and Minnie as well, mm -hmm. and Donald and Goofy. So it's definitely for everyone. And the dwarves. Oh yeah. Yes, yeah. you can't go wrong with them. So, uh, it, it, for folks that are thinking, you know, okay, maybe I've seen a Disney on Ice show recently, there's a lot of new things here, right? Yes, yes. I guess our, our highlight for sure of the show is the Silk Act, the Aerial mm -hmm. Silk Act yeah. by Rapunzel. And uh, that's the biggest and greatest, really. Um, takes your breath away. So it's she's amazing. flying above the ice? Literally. literally. With Flynn. <laughs> wow. That yes. They fly, they do tricks. It's not part of your regular skating repertoire. So mm -hmm. to get to combine both of those athletic elements together is really a sight to see. It's my favorite part. <laughs> so we were talking before we uh, came on that uh, you both are from different uh, parts of North America here. Uh, mm -hmm. And uh, how, how did you, when, what age did you start skating? Me personally, I started when I was 11. Mm -hmm. um, I loved it. I went to a homeschool skate day, and you know, as a little girl, I grew up watching the Disney on Ice shows, you know, wanting to be a princess, and um, then kind of honestly gave up on that dream. Didn't think I'd ever make it, mm -hmm. and something I kind of felt God was telling me push for and try. And so when I was about 21, I started auditioning, getting myself stronger as an athlete, and now I'm here. So it's been a dream come true for me. That's exciting. Yeah. And, and at what age were you when you started? I was three. Three? <laughs> in, wow. Yeah, I guess there's rinks all around back home in Canada. So I started on hockey skates and didn't make it too far. So I switched to figure skates and <laughs> uh -huh. made it further. And yeah. here I am as well. Uh, is there a moment in this show where people literally gasp? Or I, I've heard that there's just the reaction is pretty incredible. Yeah. Many moments, I'd say, yeah. yes. Um, there's so many lifts and, and funny reactions that happen. The stepsisters are quite hilarious. Mm -hmm. um, Yes. Yeah, and at the very end, we have a big finale scene where all the different princesses and princes come out. And it's just a really grand, huge scene, and they're all in gold and white. And that one definitely gets a very strong reaction from everyone. Just watching you know, the video is enough to make me want to go. I mean, despite <laughs> everything, or, not, or in addition to everything that you've already said here, I mean, just look at that. That's fantastic. Runs through Sunday, correct? That's correct. All right, with uh, plenty of options, even a couple of daytime shows if we've got younger ones. Yes, definitely. We have a show tonight at 7. Saturday at 11, 3, and again at 7. And then, of course, we have Sunday at 1 and 5. There we so, go. Lots Disney of opportunities to come see it. Uh, Now's the time to get your tickets. We will be right back here on Insight. Thank you.